Hello everybody and welcome here to the Sports Talk Network and welcome here to this series, Legends Your Life. Uh, specifically a couple of people that may be watching here tonight. So thank you for stopping by if you do hear watching live or otherwise. Always appreciate it. Okay, and also another shout out to the Denture. Uh, your favorite intro about that channel. There's a lot of great stuff. Um, especially past videos with regards to his journey um, as well. But either way, I always want to shout him out. And he does great work um, in regards to the videos. Now, today I have my appointment um, in regards to my top judges. As I said in my story, I had those done on their own, in their own appointment. And uh, well, the gums have gotten pretty strong through the years on the uppers. And I've uh, certainly been able to eat with them along with, you know, the real rotten teeth from the bottom before getting those pulled here in 2020. But in any hoot, I uh, went to Aspen Dental. That's the uh, dentist office, dentist place. I did go to Aspen Dental here in uh, Central, uh, Central Wisconsin. But I had a great, I mean, I would say having a great time there. I had to visit some appointments, wasn't there too long. Um, I was with the staff and Dental hygienist, seemed pretty cool that I was working with. Um, she even wanted to know more about my channel and about all that stuff. And if only, if only, well, two things to be quite honest. If only she was single, and if only I got her name or number. But she's probably not single, so there you go. But she's but, but she was kind enough to answer my questions in regards to some questions I did have to relate to all of you guys in regards to for me and in regards to uh, just learning in general you know soft lines which is hard line or a hardly line softly lines um in regards to when i would start eating um kind of uh, learning from a professional side of things that you know it's really up to the individual when they want to start introducing uh less soft foods uh for me um i try to in regards to with uh uh, toast and eggs and uh, oatmeal is a soft food in its own right, um, but just the oats with it that usually you don't chew anyways. <laughs> but either way, you know, trying to add regular, as I call regular foods, you know, beyond having my pudding, tomato soup, and um, applesauce kind of diet that I've had since uh, my surgery since that afternoon um, when I came home around lunchtime on uh, the day of July 24th of this very year. So, you know, I'm heading into the start here of week three. You're two days into the start of week three. Um, so this Friday will be three weeks from it. And then from there, one week later, will be one month. So we will get to uh, August 24th and, and, you know, WB SummerSlam and, and wrestling stuff. But for regards to dentures, um, so like I said, the appointment went well. They tried to fix it as much as they could, and then the um, with the dental hygienist, like I said, that very smart, very professional, but very immutable and awesome to a woman. Um, that I spoke with um, when he was trying to fix it when the doctor came. Um, no, so just need, need a reline because of everything that's changed for the last few years and. And everything uh, since the appointment, and since I have not worn them actively since then, whether right or wrong, uh, but it has strengthened my gums on the on my upper gums very well. So I've mainly eaten with them without even knowing it, without even uh, consciously knowing that I'm actually chewing with them as much as I was chewing with my real teeth that were still here, and in pain and other stuff at times. So. Um, also, like I said, soft line reline differences. Basically, soft lines for your immediate hard relines are for your permanence. Um, also, in regards to sensitive gums, um, and if they are some more sensitive, needing a soft reline. So, um, so with a hard, hard reline, I'm going to have that appointment in September. Um, it will be out of pocket because Aspen Dental does not accept uh, my insurance, which is fine. It is what it is. I know ahead of time, which is not wasn't anything surprising. So, uh, pay out of pocket for that appointment coming up, but I will be able to. Even though I'm still looking for work with stimulus to help me, um, regards to be able to do that. Uh, also, if you are watching live, thank you. Welcome to say hi or ask any questions or share your thoughts. Um, but all in all, I just wanted to uh, let you know all of that appointment 
as I said I would here in the continuation of this uh, series, The Denture Life. Uh, if you are new here, welcome to subscribe to the channel. I definitely love to interact with all of you. Um, I am on social media, of course, all social media, Facebook, of course. You can find me there. Find me on Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, all the places. But, like I said, all in all, the appointment went very well. Just uh, learn in regards to doing that. I learned in regards to needing a heart relung, and we'll have that appointment upcoming in September. What was that? Um, but, I, but, like I said, I really enjoyed talking to that. Um, so, hi, Jess. And, uh, hope to be quite honest, it's just one working with, um, in September when I come in again. But, just saying. But all in all, you know, it's interesting, at least to me, in regards to my journey, in regards to here to help others, those that are going through the same thing, the same point of your recovery as I am, let alone those that will be going through all this. You know, you, you know, whether you're scheduling or your teeth are hurting, you know you're going to need it. You know, I knew a little bit before. Um, finally making, you know, deciding and making decision to start giving people, uh, way back, 2017, 2018, whatever, but, um, that they just have to happen, it just needs to be done, that's for business in that regard, so, um, but even in that, and be prepared for it, it still was challenging, it still was nervous about it, um, but now, as I finally, you know, have them all out, and, like I said, watch my first video of the series to know my story in regards to this, in regards to the dentures, in regards to why it got to this point for me in my life. But I'm happy about it now. You know, I invite it, I want it, and I want to, you know, get my smile back, grow confidence again, and maybe through that, through confidence without even knowing it, building more self confidence and maybe attract me by me being funny without even knowing it or whatever. You know, I do still ramble no matter what, but either way, that's me. I am what I am. I love puzzles. I love other things. And I love pro wrestling just as much as I love pro football. But oh no. Um, you know, I hope to do more videos, not just of when I'm having these appointments, but other sort of things. Um, and just be able to talk with all of you. Uh, I'll get feedback from you all and then just interact and always I'm one to reply to comments as quickly as I can depending on when person makes the comments of course you know it might be different time zones where someone's making the comments in the morning there but I'm you know sleeping in the middle of the night here but I will reply and respond as fast as humanly possible because that's just how I am because I appreciate you taking time of your day to watch this, these videos <clears throat> excuse me let alone the comment on them and share your thoughts or or ask a question. If you all, if any of you have an idea of like a video I should do, that's fine too. Um, but either way, like I said, I uh, had a great experience again. A place called Aspen Dental, and uh, great people, knowledgeable staff, um, and and definitely uh, would recommend to those that are here in the uh, central, north central area here of Wisconsin um, to uh, check them out. Great place, great place for sure, um, and. No, Steve sent you, uh, from, again, like I said, a series called The Dental Life, and I, uh, just want to be here for an inspiration for people, you know, an, an inspiration in the sense of, hey, I went through it, and I'm one that worries so much, and a few who may have more self-confidence than I do, but still worry, or you can make this for two, I'm not saying it's easy, I'm not saying it's, you know, fun in regards to the surgery or the, the beginning of the recovery, but, Still, it's to each his own. Maybe for you, it'll be a little bit easier, better experience than it was for me or like for somebody else. Like for me, it was easier than another YouTuber that went, obviously went through the experience and, and had surgery and was having a little bit more difficulty in the beginning. For me, both the appointments, whether it was the first one with the uppers or the second one with, uh, with the lowers, went smoothly for me. Sorry, I was trying to, I was bringing the microphone closer because I didn't know if I needed it closer for my voice. and my uh, Peruvian dialect or uh, accent, but um, either way, I look forward to my future, and I look forward to being able to, to build my confidence again, maybe find a mate, have a family at an older age here, um, start my own family, you know, I love being an uncle, but I don't have my own family, it would be so, 
super duper awesome too, obviously. You know, so you know, if the Undertaker can have a young child at fifty four he is, um as his first child with his second wife. But I hope they just have one wife <laughs> and um build a family with her. Uh because whoever becomes my wife, uh whoever Whoever that person, that rookie son of a gun is, he's also um, entering an interesting situation with me. Just in the sense of, you know, I'm weird, I'm wacky, I'm interesting and in different ways. I have different interests, but the person I look for is someone that um, would love me for me and the stuff that I love. Whether it's D&D, &D, pro wrestling, pro football, um, lo you know, loving rom-coms as much as I love superhero movies. Um... I like Disney Channel shows still, and uh, this and that. Like right now, I'm, well, I have on silent though, but watching Coop and Cammy Ask the World, you know, another great show, along with Sydney to the Max, two best shows. I was just watching back to back on Disney Channel. <clears throat> Excuse me, but on all things are doing going well for me. The appointment, like I said, went well. I'm um, doing the Harvey Lens in September. I will be going to that appointment, of course, September 12th. Have my appointment with the other place for uh, see in September if I got approved by my insurance because that location does accept my insurance. I'm approved for lower dentures at that other place, closer to my home, as well. But um, other fine establishment, uh, and this office for uh, that, and hopefully in September I can have uh, the molding done on the road to getting my lower. But all in all, there you go. But I think all that were here for the really short time they were. Uh, thank you all. I hope you all enjoy this video. If you watch it while it's, when it's archived, as I call it, when it goes to post to the channel. Like I said, if you want to leave a comment, that's cool. If, uh, if that dental hygienist who was... Uh, working with me and talking to me this, af this afternoon, wanted to do, leave a comment, share, or send me a DM on social media, or, or send me an email, or however, um, that person in contact with you to interview you, to talk to you, or otherwise. Um, but all in all, I think I'm done talking here and talking in circle. So, just want, like I said, share that and give that update. Um, so things are moving in that direction for, you know, both, you know, fixing the tops and the upper dentures and then the bottom dentures as well. I also did ask in regards to eating meat and uh, she said and the doctor said um, that, you know, it's really up to the individual. They, were, they said they had a patient once that really wanted to have a steak and ate steak two days after having extractions. And it hurt like the son of a gun, but I guess the person still did it because he wanted a steak. For me, I'm trying to adhere by the guidelines and rules or, or law or whatever of what they say. You know, what they, and even I ask, you know, are these, you know, fast rules? Are they high, high suggestions? Um, and they say, well, to each their own, you know, however, however you feel. Um, if you want to try something, that's up to you. Um, but these guidelines are put in place for a reason. So, that's understandable. For sure, you know, guidelines are there in place for a reason. I get that. Um. But, yeah, I really wish I remembered that digital hygienist name. But all in all, all in all, all in all, all in all, it was a great experience. I think Ashton Dental for, uh, for being a great place. And, you know, like I said, knowledgeable kind and, and all that other stuff. Uh, but anyways, for Pop, I can start having my mug rip beer again. I might have that after I'm done with this live. I do love my mug rip beer. But... Hope you all have a great rest of your evening, your day, whenever you are watching this, and hope to hear from all of you, however to hear all of you, from all of you. I have seen I got 80 views in regards to my very first video. If only 80 of you, if you all were new people and not just subscribers, but either way, I appreciate it. If you are already subscribers, and thank you, if you there were new people, welcome to subscribe to the channel, you know, give it a chance, give it a shot. And I uh, always love to hear feedback, thoughts, positive or negative, at least for being honest. And even if you disagree on topics or thoughts, it makes for good and respectful debates, I would say. 
So with that being said, hope you all have a great rest of your evening. Otherwise, and above all else, as always, take care.